Hi everyone. This week, we're gonna talk about the basics of getting your digital ecosystem started. And with that, we're gonna first start and talk about your website. We have a couple of key components that you need to take into consideration when you are thinking about either launching a website, rebuilding, or looking at your website with fresh eyes today. Number one, your website needs to be easy to navigate. Let me explain this a bit further. <laughs> Let's put it into food service perspective. If you walk into a hotel and you can't tell where the bar is, where check-in is, where the bathrooms are, where the elevator is, what do you do? Either A, you're confused and you need to go ask somebody for help, right? Or B, you instantly decide you don't like this hotel. Same thing with a restaurant, right? Think of your website in the exact same way. When people land on your website, they need to instantly know where to go, what they're look how to find what they're looking for, and what it is that you're about to help them with. Step number two, do not discount quality video and quality photo. Sound matters, light matters, blurriness, not so good, right? If you have a really expensive test kitchen or you have a really expensive piece of equipment that you're selling and people come and they see a photo of it and it's all messy or it's blurry, why would they spend a lot of money on that? Why would they think it's high end? So think of all the impressions that you're making when someone lands on your website and they look at these images. That is the story that you're telling because you are not in person telling the story. Logos, the quality of the logo matters. Don't have a blurry logo. I can't read it, it doesn't look good. You look messy, to be honest. Don't look messy. You wanna look and put your best foot forward. Just like you're going on a date. Think of it as a date, right? You show up to your date, and you look your best, you know, you tidy up your hair, you look spiffy, it's the same thing on your website. So make sure that you are paying attention to the quality of the video and the photos that you put up there. So now let's talk about step three. Step three is another one that food service friends, I gotta tell you, we have some uh, splaining to do, and that is using high quality creative design. A graphic designer, graphic design in general, is well worth every penny that you spend. And quite frankly, it's the difference between a well-marketed company and a not well-marketed company. If you look around at your competition, every single company that you see spending major time, major money, and being very successful in marketing, do they look like the hot mess express in their design? No. Do they look like they did clip art their way to bringing you a brochure or a flyer or an email? No, they don't. There's a reason why you looked at them and you said that company is well marketed and that company is who I want to be like. It's because they're paying attention to the design. So don't discredit that with your website. People are looking at it. It needs to look good. So those are my three easy tips. They're simple. You can go evaluate your website today, see if you're hitting the mark, and at least get started from here on what you maybe wanna change or where you can invest a little bit more.